Hey guys, what's up? I'm Sakatron here from One Hive Gazette. Here with my next live on War Day uh, series video. This is one of the ones that you guys uh, mentioned you wanted to see a little bit more. So, got one here today, and we're going to be taking a look at some of the live attacks as they happen from this war. So, be right back with our first one. Alright, here we go. It looks like we got Rich going in against 20 and caught it a little bit later than I would have liked to, but it uh, looks like he's coming in with a few dragons. Kind of an old-fashioned dragon deployment just a few of them to get in there take out the queen uh, we'll see if they get the job done then coming in with a few golems at the bottom some wizards uh, just creating the funnel nicely dropping down the queen letting her just do some work on these defenses nice and early before everything reroutes there's the jump spell nice placement there uh, the dragons are kind of going off one of them has already died the other one's heading south so might not get that queen taken out uh, that could be an issue anyway though the jump spell is down um, everything's moving forward. The king went in, uh, Pekka in the CC, but that should go down pretty quickly. Uh, went ahead and dropped the poison on it. That dragon, yeah, it did avoid the queen, so we'll see if his kill squad can get the queen taken out. But he has triggered one set of double giant bombs and popped a few Teslas, so that's great. Um, sending in the hogs now, they're just going to make their way through this base pretty quickly. Um, take out these defenses, has a nice heal. Uh, everything making their way through very nicely. The poison was great on the king. A few skelly traps are popping, but the hogs are doing it right. The problem is the queen looks like she's going to be an issue. She's still up. Uh, he has his own queen at the bottom there with her ability, but she's just getting through that wall now. Uh, the defensive queen's only level 9, I think that is. Kind of small, but yeah, level 9. Um, and she's taken out quite a few of these hogs. Both heroes on the hogs plus the skelly traps, they're going down pretty quickly. Still has a big group of them, though. Uh, the queen, his queen's starting to shoot set down some of the skeleton traps. Now, right now, yeah, she got on the queen, so queen's down. Uh, up top there, looks like the king's engaging the defensive king. Those last few hogs just got the Tesla. I think this is going to be a three-star, yeah. Wow, uh, yeah, that king just went down. Both kings went down right there, so looks like he has plenty of time to get it done. We'll go ahead and start the Wu train. Awesome job to Rich, getting the three-star. Didn't quite go to plan, but worked out okay. Kind of cool seeing some vintage dragons, because uh, we typically don't see just like the two dragons like they used to be used but kind of malfunctioned wor worked out on okay uh, his queen luckily came through and got the job done took out the defensive queen so all good nice attack to rich um, we'll go ahead and wait for the next attack in just a moment okay here we go looks like we have peaked too soon going in against 19 uh, dropping down the queen few healers on her, just going to let her start taking out a few buildings. Looks like he has a dragon attack queued up, so uh, going to go in for two of those air defenses. Uh, yeah, and then I guess he'll zap Quake one of the other ones and maybe use the king and a golem. Yeah, there's the golem. So it looks like the king and the golem will go for the top air defense up there, while the queen's going to go for these bottom two, which are pretty exposed. She does have to deal with the Lava Hound, which is a time sink. This is going to take up some time but might have enough time to get the job done. Uh, his king's a little bit late. That golem's taking quite a bit of damage, but uh, there goes the king. He'll get in there, take out the defensive king, then should make his way in for that air defense. Uh, right here, the Lava Hound's about to pop. Just a moment. Uh, yep, there it goes. Yep, there goes Lava Hound. It pops, uh, so Queen will take out those pups. Went ahead and zap quaked the air defense up top. So all air defenses are down, uh, using minions to create the funnel for his dragons, it looks like. Drops the rage to, for her for the queen and take out those last few air defenses. Here comes the uh, dragons. You can see the king and the golem took out like one of those Teslas, but most of the Tesla farm is still up. That could be an issue. Um, a lot of this base is still up, to be honest, but um, has a bunch of dragons, no air defenses. Plus, most of this guy's... Uh, Archer Towers and Expos is pretty low level, so should be able to get the job done if everything goes okay. Minute 25 on the clock, the dragons are a little bit spread out on some of this high HP, which could be an issue. And the queen is about to go down. Yep, she goes down. The Skelly Traps, uh, two point defense took her down. So unfortunately, those healers are just going to sit there now. Uh, drops the poison on a few Skellies, it looks like. Uh, but the dragons are spread pretty thin, and I think they're gonna they're not going to get the job done right here. Just too much HP in that area. Um, and they kind of, all that trash at the bottom, had those few dragons funneled in correctly, maybe would have had it, but uh, this one's not going to be a three star. Good try to peek too soon. The plan was solid. I think just the dragons were a little bit off, so it happens, and uh, he'll run out of time here. We'll go ahead and say nice try uh, to peek, or 
yeah, I said to Rich, I met Peak too soon. Mistake there. Uh, yeah, because Rich was in the chat. That's why I screwed up. Uh, we'll go ahead and type that up. There we go. Um, yeah, anyway, the dragons making their way through, but obviously not enough time uh, as, these, as they face these last few Teslas. Um, go ahead and put an emoji in. Yeah, not going to be a three-star. Good try to PTS, but doesn't quite get it. Um, wait for these last few dragons to go down, and then we'll go ahead and get in here and take a look at another attack, which I will be right back with. All right, here we go. Uh, we have <clears throat> Christian going in on number 21. And I, I was a little bit late, I'm sorry. Just kind of slipped past me. Um, missed the beginning, but has some Valks. Has a big kill squad, both his heroes, the Valks, the Golems, Wizards, all of that just stormed the middle of the base, it looks like. I uh, had a jump spell to let everything in. Then just sent his hogs through. We'll maybe look at this again on a replay, just because I wasn't... I want to make sure you guys see the whole attack. Wasn't quite sure what happened there, but just crush this base. I mean, it's only been going on for like a minute, uh, but this base is already done. Uh, Hog's making their way through. Has one more heal, which he doesn't even need, but he goes ahead and drops it here. Uh, the king's beating on the wall. He'll help with cleanup. Still has a ton of Valks, Golems, Queen, Hogs, just everywhere. Sprinkling in these last few Hogs just for cleanup. Awesome attack to Christian. Missed the beginning, but when I, from what we saw, it looked like this base was getting wrecked pretty Pretty seriously, that last double giant bomb set goes off to the queen. Luckily, the hogs avoided it, but it didn't matter even. Um, we'll take a look at the replay again. Let me just go back and find it, but uh, put a woo in first for Christian. Awesome attack, and then we'll go ahead and back out. And looks like we have a live defense, but I'm not going to show it. Uh, these guys aren't bringing very good attacks. Anyway, though, uh, comes in at the bottom here. Looks like he has two golems. And I believe that CC will have Valks in it. I don't see what else it would have in it, unless it has Hogs or something. But it looks like he created a nice wide funnel here. Spreads out those Golems pretty wide, which he can do, because they're not taking a lot of damage, the point defense is low level. Drops a nice little Hog on the left side, takes out that Mortar, then goes and gets that Cannon. So funnel is perfect. I mean, this couldn't have been created better. The Valks have nowhere to go but into the base here. Uh, drops the CC, which looks like, yeah, has those level 5 Valks, which are pretty OP with giant shoulder pads and everything, a max wizard to go with them. Everything kind of moves forward, takes that jump, converges on those heroes, has the heal for the Valks. They're going to tear through those heroes, plus all those buildings in that little core section there. And then, yeah, we'll just fast forward because we've already seen this. The hogs come through uh, west to east, basically, under a few heals, getting the job done, crushed the base, awesome attack to Christian. Um, I will be right back with the next attack. We should have one more for you guys. All right, here we go with Genbok. This might be the last one I do. Um, we'll see, but uh, Genbok going in on 14. And uh, I know you guys want to see some Town Hall 8, Town Hall 10 action. It's just that uh, Town Hall 10s are going to be attacking at the end of the war. I won't be on to record at that time, probably. And then Town Hall 8s, we don't have any uh, in this war. So um, I'll, I'll make sure to focus as much as I can on those other Town Hall levels, including Town Hall 11s, too, because we have a few of those. But I'll focus on those in some other videos. Anyway, that's just going to be a Town Hall 9 uh, live on War, uh, War Day series video uh, for this one. But maybe we'll have some other Town Hall levels in other videos on this series. Anyway, though, uh, drops down the Rage. I don't know if you needed that Rage because the cannon just had gone down. And it's only one point defense on the Queen. So Rage probably wasn't necessary, but was getting kind of low. Better safe than sorry, I guess. I've had that happen to me before uh, where the Queen goes down because I'm too stingy with the Rages. So, works out okay. Looks like the queen will meet up with the kill squad. Everything is going to enter the base in one cohesive unit, which is nice. Uh, wall breakers in, has the golem, the king, wizards creating the funnel. Here come the Valks. Uh, we've seen a lot of Valks at Town Hall 9. They're pretty powerful right now, like I've said, if you couldn't tell by all the videos I've been making about them. Uh, and this guy obviously did not watch my video on how to build an anti-Valk base, because it is perfect for Valks. Drops down that jump, they have access to the entire core, and I'm guessing there's some uh, giant bombs in there. Sprinkles in these hogs around the outside, which I, I've also said that's something that's going to happen. Um, just sprinkling them in around the outside, no possibilities for giant bombs really, or at least double giant bombs, might be a few singles or something. Anyway though, they get in there, take out the defensive king. Those healers got great value because they, they're still up healing things. Right now they're just starting to go down a little bit, but they've 
been doing, uh, getting a lot of value. There's that Tesla farm, bottom left. Uh, looks like he's going to save the heal for that. Luckily, that he those healers got on the hogs for a moment. So the hogs are pretty much full health going into this Tesla farm. Deploys a few more. Uh, looks like that heal spell missed a little bit, but no big deal. They'll get in the heal spell in just a moment as they step up right here. And the queen's helping on that expo anyway. Uh, crush this base. Awesome attack to Genbok. Town Hall 9 looking pretty easy right now with the Valks. Um, then again, we haven't seen the best bases, so we'll have to wait for the next ranged war before we can really see the state of Town Hall 9. But um, I'm confident in my decision to go to Town Hall 10. I'll talk more about that later. Um, but for now, this is concluding the Live on War Day series video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Still waiting for that Tesla to go down, but it should in just a moment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, Sectatron out.